Alright guys, and welcome back to Stellar Blade. Oh god, you know, I'm, I'm hesitating here because I know what's coming. Or at least I think I know what's coming. Straight up ahead, Scavenger Adam says, Go to the Alpha Natiba location. I don't want to do this. I've got to go and fight a big boss. I don't think I'm ready for this. I'm not sure I'm ready for the edits I'm going to have to do just to get through it. Let's let's start off with a little sneaky dicky attack. Oh god, we can't sneaky dicky attack that one. Let's do this one instead. Oh, oh I tell you what, combos. Whoa! Oh, I forgot about that. Okay, I forgot I unlocked a new skill there. Oh no. Anyway, uh, how are you? Hope all is well. Um, I'm being attacked en masse by a bunch of critters, and I don't like it. I got something out of that, but it wasn't what I was hoping for. Okay, okay, we're taking too much damage here. Oh, that one exploded. All good. He's done. He's got to be done. There's no, there's no pieces of his pixels left alive. Oh, he's blowing up. Oh, that's what's happening. Okay, my 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 mild panic attack is over. Um, I hope everyone's all right. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, here we go, here we go. Okay, got one of these bridges. Now I know what these are about. I wonder if they're going to get harder. Up. Up, up. Right, right. Left, down. Left, right. Up, down. Left, left. Up, right, right. Left. Oh, get in there. We had a third of the time left to go. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Now, where have we got our heads in? That was uh, an unfortunate moment. Uh, oh, hang on a minute. We've got a dead body of some poor fool up here. Let's see what he was all about. Legionnaire 220's memory. Well, coming over to section 59. Sorry about the voice. <clears throat> I saw what was falling from the sky. There was no orbital explosion. In fact, I wish I never saw it at all. Now I know there's hope left. There's no hope left for this land. Quite a different sentence if you read it the first way I did. There's no hope. Oh, wow. Yeah, I see what he means. There's certainly no hope in that direction. Let's go. Come on. Can we do anything here? No. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I see, I see the fool at the end. Enemy at the back, but there's one sneaking around the corner here. Hold on. Come on, come on. I'm gonna pull this guy back. Ah, oh, because I was hoping the one behind him wasn't gonna see me. Come on, you blow up right there and take your mate out with you. Ah, oh, they don't do damage on their own. That I will take. That was beautiful. Okay, some of these combos, the combo, uh, com combos, the combinations of the combos are a little tricky to remember, so it's a case of spam, spam occasionally and you might get one lucky. Square, square, triangle, square, triangle, triangle, hold triangle, hold square in a random sequence. Oh, it's collapsing. Okay, does this mean I don't have to fight the, the, the main boss? Do you think you can come down here? Who, who said that? Oh, we've got to go that way. All right, hang on a second. I didn't explore this corridor. No need. Let's go back. Oh, damn it. I'm trying anything to try to avoid this alpha boss fight, but it is what it is. We've got to do it. we got to do it. Oh, look at you. Oh, no. Oh, okay. That's a first. Game is really kind to... <laughs> the game was kind to me there, because most of the time... These... Oh, would you just, for the love of all that is... F right. Be steady and be careful. There is something over here. Hold on. There we go. Needed to use the circle. Right. Get lost and back off. 
There we go. Okay, now there's, there's a climbable wall here. This is the thing I saw in the first place. I thought, well, what is that? What is this you're, you're dealing? You're dealing me? I know what I meant. Okay, swing. Shawing. Alright. Uh, oh, that's not collectible. Really? Really? What is this? Scanning for enemies. Maybe down below. And an advanced polymer material. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Yeah, that's where I just came from. Right, we're pressing on. I really do want to level up a little more, but, um... Okay, how do we do this? How do we do this? Okay, that works. That works. Yeah, I want to level up, but I, I, I just... Not found enough resources. Equipment. Legionnaire 248's complaint. Completed setting up the seventh camp, the very last one. Returning to headquarters. <gasps> that was that was the sigh. I hope you appreciated that. Now where now where? We've not got a hell of a lot going on. Oh, I do have to go that way. Oh well, at least we know now. There's another one of those balloon robots downstairs. Oh yes. That was satisfying. You see that little balloon thing? The blue one? I'm coming for you, buddy. Or maybe not. <laughs> Ouch! Now, do I want to do this? We'll find out in a minute. Oh, it's beautiful. <clears throat> Alright. Worth checking out every nook and cranny for things like that. Extreme nano element of that dude as well. That says authorized only. Oh, okay, I thought it was gonna blow up. Ooh. I don't like this. Are they facing me or are they facing away from me? Alright, we're kicking ass here. Be gone, foul one. I think that's actually it down here. Little XP, and off we go. Uh, oh, I thought I could jump from there, but nope. Let's take a short break here. Oh, we found another little rest point. Honestly, they keep throwing the skills at me. It's um, impressive how rapidly they they come up. Increase the amount of beta energy recharged with a successful perfect parry. Well, that barely happens to me, but I'll take it anyway. Thank you. We have to open the valve to supply water. Okay. Don't want to go mess with those creatures if I don't have to. Oh, no. It's a leap of faith. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't just jump straight into the water. It's not working. We'll have to do this manually. Ugh. 
Huh? We can't do it manually without the key. Okay then. Things. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with the gobby, spitty fools. Just a little bit of that. And try to avoid the explosion. Come on. Legionnaire 268's prayer. It looks like the network is completely disconnected. I tried reconnecting to it, but nothing works. My head feels so empty. Where is Mother Sphere? I can't feel her anymore. Mother, please save That's us. It. That's our key. All right, well, that was Mother Sphere. Mother Sphere was basically the overlord that sent the Eve program, including me and all my dead beautiful sisters down to the surface to deal with this problem. Now it's working. Okay, I don't think that it works that I could just have... There isn't enough water. Hold on. I could have just you fallen. Have to dive down to open a different valve. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that. I've got that. I'm just going to get my uh, what little health I lost back. I know I've respawned some of the creatures, but that's okay. Because we're going to blissfully avoid them. Yeah, I don't think it works. But I, could, I couldn't I could have dived into the, uh, the water earlier on. Uh, we've got to tunnel that way. Let me just see if we got anything down below. Now, so far, when playing as Eve, she hasn't really suffered from any uh, lack of oxygen. She seems drownless. Could be wrong. Oh, but we must explore because of things like this. Uh, we found the key. Right, we found another key. Not the key. Another key. I'm not getting through there. So what? So what? Oh, this ladder, perhaps. Oh, yes. I like that, though. The game automatically switches you to the right side of the ladder, no matter, no matter which one you pick. The leg speed, nothing from this fella. Take all of that. Ah, I see what we're doing here. Opening each floodgate to get us a little higher in the level. Now that's full. We've got to dive that back through. You can get out by going back to where you started. Yeah, all right, I got it. I understand. I'm picking up what you're laying down here, buddy. says this way all right we're, 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 no, please get up 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 eve okay little little annoying the controls there there we go <laughs> are we all good we're all good let's move on still 200 meters to go or 200 the exits to the right we're almost there. 200 units to go. Yeah, we're almost there. I like that. Don't lead me into this false sense of safety or security. I know what's going on. Oh, gimme, gimme, gimme. And back off. There we go. What do we get there? Drone upgrade module. I've still not upgraded the drone at all. A drone. I shouldn't call him a drone. It's Adam. Finally outside. 
Oh, this feels the refreshing. Over there. That area is Alpha Nativa territory. What's a drop pod doing there? It was abandoned a long time ago. Matter of fact, it's what made this crater. Wait, that's a fifth airborne squad drop pod. That's what I was thinking. Fifth airborne. Let's take a closer look. A little newer than the fourth airborne. But uh, that's exactly what I thought when I saw it. The crater. Okay, this is nice. I, I was I was sort of mentioning in the in the last episode, like we we haven't really got a a new biome to play around in. Okay, there's no point in going backwards. You never know, though. All good RPGs give you a reason to just check behind you before you go too far forward. When you, especially when you landed in a new area, because you know they might leave something up. God damn it! Trying to prove my point here. The game doesn't want me to. Legionnaire 274's memory. Elite division Athena has been wiped out. The lacerated state of the corpses tells us it's the work of a single Nitiba. What was that sound? Something is coming this way. Fast. Damn it, it's here. Okay, we're about to die horribly, aren't we? Let me get up here, take this conveniently placed safe point. Ooh, we got a sleeping bag this time. Uh, right, activating camp. Camp activated. Skill settings, no. What I want to do, I really want to upgrade something. Uh, weapon core, I can't do. Nano suit. Ooh, oh, look at that. One more extreme polymer material to make this rather fetching outfit. But not today. We do have an upgrade... For the chain type exo spine, increase the attack power of combo attacks level two or higher, and we can afford it. It's done. I haven't unlocked this this lower beta skill. Delivers a sudden strike, stuns, hit enemies, and deal high damage. But I wonder if I should just put some points in upgrading the others. I can't yet because I haven't. I've only got one bloody skill point. But I don't have this one. Let's get this one. I don't know. Whether it's good. Press and hold buttons to charge. Okay, right. I suppose I don't do enough of that. Don't do enough of the charging. Eve, it's pretty faint, but I'm picking up a distress signal coming from that drop pod. That means... There might still be survivors. Really? I can't say for sure, and the Alpha and Atiba could appear at any moment. I mean... So let's make sure we're well prepared. Come on, you know, you know I'm not well prepared. I'm not well anything. I'm never prepared. I always go headlong, rushing in like a fool, like I'm about to. Towards a drop pod and towards a boss fight. So be it. Let's do it. Hmm. Let's see what's here. Wait. I hear something. Yep, same thing the dead guy behind us did. Eve, look up! Whoa, look at you! Oh dear lord! <laughs> what design! Whoa, good dodge. What a design! Absolutely beautiful looking creature. Right, what do you do? Okay, you do that. And you do that, but I can do this. Alright, alright, you got you. Yeah, alright, fair game, fair game. Got a little cocky there. Oh yeah, alright, come on. 
What was that I just did? That's, I think that's my new skill that I hadn't learnt yet. Oh, get in. Second phase. And he just blew me away. Come on. I'm in the mood for dancing. Oh, that blink skill is just superb. When it works, of course. Oh, come on. Oh, a waste of a beat. Oh, I had that built up as well. So close. Need to heal. Come on. I think butt shots are the way to go. Oh, get in. I think we're done. That was just so much quicker. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh. Oh, God. I thought we were going to enter a phase two there. Giga's trophy is mine. Awesome. Okay, that was a good fight. I enjoyed that. A couple of goes, probably out the edit, but that was a lot of fun. Shield enhancement gear is done. Now, let me go back. Let me go back to camp because I might be able to upgrade something. Something I've been meaning to upgrade for a while. In fact, no upgrade, just actually, uh, it might be cosmetic. I don't know. Do it, does it come with new skills? Nano suit. There we go. It's ready. Now, what do I get with it? Changes the appearance. Is that all it does? I've been seeking this out just for, just for a little change. But why not? All it does is give me a new look. Equip it. Equip it, it did. So, what do you think? Worth it? I'm not sure either. Uh, enhanced thing. Attack power increased. Beautiful. Hang on a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just saw something else there. Gear socket expansion level one. Gear sockets have been expanded. I love it when that happens. I love it when my gear sockets get expanded. <laughs> now, if I rest here, don't worry, the boss won't respawn. That's one thing that I got the guarantee. We got the guarantee from the from the devs that only the minions respawn. Bosses don't. So if I find that it does happen. Unlike the demo, which lied to us. Let's grab this thing. My goodness. I can't believe this. This is the Alpha Nateba. Oh, I thought it was a boss. You can tell by looking at its core. An Alpha Core. Alpha Course. She were... Eve. Hmm? Uh, there's something you need to know. The truth is... Hello? Here! <gasps> Can somebody rescue me? Oh, there's please. one more of us! In the pod. If you're there, please help. Oh, is it gonna be... It won't be. No, it's a new, it's a new person. What the? Uh, a survivor from the airborne squad. Oh. Were you the one who sent the rescue signal? Huh? Oh, yes. Yes, it was me. It's a child. You're a member of the 7th airborne squad, right? Yes. And you? Right. Let me introduce myself. I'm an engineering support of the 5th Airborne Squad. Lily Artemis II. Okay, we all know what you want to grow up to be. But you can just call me Lily. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. I mean... So many thoughts. So just to recap, you were in that hideout waiting for another squad to arrive for almost two years? And then you met us. Yes. Thank you so much for saving me. I've been waiting a long time for the next squad to come in. It's been really lonely uh, here. Two years? That's an understatement. It's really lucky we were able to find you when we did. Eve, you're from the Airborne Squad Assault Force, right? Yes. Then I can be your engineering support. Of course, I will need proper equipment first. Equipment? Hmm. Well, I did want to say something earlier. What is it? Actually, there's a city where other survivors, besides me, live. What? Really? <laughs> it's called Zion, humanity's last city. If we go there, there might be people that can help us. I have a safe house with some equipment I bet you would want. Then let's head there quickly! Before that, I would like to ask you something. Currently, Zion is holding out under the guidance of Oracle, who is also our spiritual leader. It's complicated. Eve, I imagine completing your mission isn't any easier having lost your comrades. So, please, help me save Zion. If you do, I promise Oracle and I will do everything we can to help you on your mission. It's about joining forces and helping each other, just like we did before. Sound good? Oh, oh, look at this. I've got options. Cooperate or do not cooperate. I mean, who the hell is going to say no? I mean, I don't know if that's a good... Uh, you've got to go along with things. Is this a defining moment in the game? Is what we choose now going to decide the fate of all the living creatures and beings left alive on Earth that are human, of course? Or is this just a distraction? Yeah, go on then, whatever. Yes. Thanks to teamwork, I was able to get the Alpha Core. Maybe we can get more information in the city, Eve. Think about it. Yes. I suppose there's no reason to say no. However, I want to decide after hearing the story from that person you're calling Orkel. That shouldn't be a problem. Okay. I can definitely get behind that idea. Well... I guess that settles that. All right then, let's head to Zion. Yes! Wow. Oh, okay, I thought we were gonna have to march for miles and potentially hours to Zion. But somebody had the good idea of bringing the ship. Thanks, Adam. All right, I feel like we made a decent amount of progress today. So far, we're not done yet. I do want to change this music though. That's the thing with the game though. It's, it's, it's I mean, the, the music's good. It's, I like it, but it is, it, it, it does repeat uh, quite rapidly. Like the songs aren't that long. And so it's just like I've, I've fallen asleep with the earworm of the songs from this game. Wow, look at that. It's huge. It's surprising to see a city in a place like this. During its prime, over a hundred thousand people called it home. Obviously, now there are fewer. <laughs> Obviously. The place you see below is my safe house. The auxiliary engine's output is weak, so things can get bumpy. Hold on tight. Okay, something's gonna happen here. Me fair warning. Or is that all a bit of drama for nothing? Oh, come on, man. You could have just landed and apologized after. Sorry, uh, landings can be a bit bumpy around here. Wow, a whole city underneath the wasteland. Wow, that is pretty impressive. It's amazing. Everybody lives on top of each other, literally. Even in the darkest times, it's always safe to bet on human survival instinct. So, where do we go? No time for breaks. Typical leave. 
Well, I guess I mean we, at least we got a new a Oracle new is in the present suit. Team. Follow me. A new costume. It does look pretty good. I got to say, it's a little better than the shiny green one. Uh, I I do like them. I, I understand though. <laughs> You're probably wondering why she's got a cravat and a sort of a a chess piece. Is that the the original design of these costumes was such that that wasn't there, so it. There was a bit of an outcry from people who thought that it was objectifying women, and I, I kind of get their point of view, but you know, it's uh, so they covered it up, and um, she's now kind of censored, is what they're calling it. There's a bit of an outcry about that as well, so honestly, pick your camp, I don't really care. Um, but uh, just to explain that she's wearing a cravat, a collar, and a thing, because before she, they did that wasn't there, so you got a bit of cleavage, if you know what I mean. Resting up. Do I need to rest? Oh, I don't need to rest. Do I need to use the shop? No. Do I need to check my skills? Probably, because I must have earned a packet after beating that beast. Which I did. Ooh. Oh, hello. Uh, what is this? Can only be used after f defeating an enemy with ambush or assault charges at a nearby enemy to attack. Oh, it's like a double assassination. Ooh, that could be interesting. If I can remember that I have it. I mean, good, you just got to see the prompt. I'm going to try this one because that sounds cool. Double sneak assassination. But I doubt we're going to need that in this section here. Got a fast travel point there. All right, come on. Looks like they built the city deep and high. Deep and high. She is quite the student of observation, isn't she? So yeah, shipping containers largely up top. Are all those walls around the city supposed to protect it from their Tiba attacks? That's right, that's what walls do. They either keep people in or keep people out. I'm sorry, but I'm not convinced by this character's naivety. Walls don't seem to be as reinforced as well as they should be. I don't know, I don't know, there's something about her that's grating on me. We'll figure it out though. Well, welcome to Zion. What's that? The main, the central electric Whoa, hub. What is this place? <clears throat> it's a city. I wonder how the colony would react if they knew about this. <laughs> Or well, they'd probably get excited, like like you just did. Most likely, there will be a protocol to rescue everyone. I think so. It'll be a big project. Will. Okay, sorry, but I've got to stop interjecting. Be possible to contact the colony. Uh, we have to go to the present. Uh, we have to go. Eve, here. They don't want me to go to uh, the vending we machine. Have to go to the oh, oh, come on! A, a, a moment on the lips doesn't necessarily mean a lifetime. Oh. I hope that day comes soon. A lifetime on the hips. God damn it, they stopped me eating. Adam, why are the streets so empty? Everybody's dead. Is Lily. everyone hiding because of us? And you're next. We have a situation here. A situation? You'll see. When you get to the presence chamber. Oh, that's the oh, the serial killer stuff. This is. Yes, I'll show you. Let's just go down into the basement so I can explain. Oh God, we're all about to die. Oh well, it's been a good game. How about if I go this way? Oh God, I thought I was tricking them. Here. Okay, yeah, all right, I'm following. I've got to be a good girl. And follow Adam because he knows everything. He knows what's best. I want to come back. I want to go to the city and explore, though. There, there was a lot of alleyways to <laughs> get scared down, and 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 back streets to have questionable surgery in. Oh. Come on, we're almost there. Come on, you come on. I'm just gonna. Use the shop for no reason at all, other than I reserve my right to to free will, and I can't rest here either. All right, that means something is about to happen in this room. Oh, look at these two! Wow! I'm 
sorry, I know you can't really see it up close. I have to... Look at you, what even are you? This reminds me of um, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, you know those giant walking giraffes? It's, it's a sort of a flying saucer type head that really is reminiscent of that. Minus the giraffe body, that's what first came to mind. And you look like something out of potentially a slutty Star Wars movie. Yeah, right that I've it's never watched, while. honestly. Looks like you brought guests. Very important guests. Can you open the door? Go. Oracle is waiting for you. I mean, this is this is the soon, right? <laughs> R-rated Star Wars for sure. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. <laughs> I just did. I was just enjoying myself. So, so she's got a. a, a an entry, obviously, maybe that's her trade, but but she's got a, a an entry in my databank. Lily's clothes unlocked. You can now change, I can change Adam's and Lily's clothes. Gear sockets have been expanded. Oh, okay, it's the first time I've been in the pause menu for a while. Uh, but hold on a minute here. Databank, databank. Natiba, no, she's not a Natiba. Character, oh. Well, there you are, Rael. Rael is a mysterious warrior who protects the presence chamber. Citizens of Zion call her the Royal Guard. Some say she was an assassin. Some say she is a Natiba who turned against her own kind. After being enlightened by the Prophet, and some even say that she is a prototype angel. All rumors aside, one thing is crystal clear. Rael will do anything for Orkel and Zion. Wow, this is so cool. And here's Lily. Have a little read of Lily's biop. Uh, and Adam. Adam, well, Tacky, we know. Tacky, we, we sort of lost, but I have a feeling that Tacky is going to come back. We miss Tacky. She was lovely. Right, what do we do now? I like how now I've changed our outfits. We actually all kind of matching. It's like we called each other ahead and uh, decided to w Whoa, go with the, the golden place. black numbers. This is where the memories are kept, right? You've got a keen eye. That's right. The presence chamber is where memories are stored. The memories of those who couldn't make it back to Mother Sphere. Over here. Whoa. Oh. I see we have guests. Welcome. Oh my god. This is what I see Let the future of the, the human race is. This is Zion's prophet, Oracle. I'm airborne squad member Eve. My name's Lily. Pleased to meet you. Adam has told me all about you. You defeated an Alpha Natiba. Yeah, yeah, no. Could you show me anything it might have dropped? Here. Oh, it's an Alpha Core. Please, a moment. Your objective is to rid the world of the Elder Natiba, the leader of all other Natibas. Well then, I suppose you're trying to use the Alpha Core as a key to open the way forward to the Nest. Is that right? Absolutely right. How did you know that? Unfortunately, the Nest cannot be opened with the Alpha Core alone. What? No way! <laughs> But is... is there really no other way to reach the nest? By fusing four Alpha Cores together, you create something called a Master Core. Only with the Master Core will you be able to reach the very deepest corner of the nest. How... how do you know all this? Thanks to my personal link to the facility on the surface, 
I can search anywhere and everywhere on Earth. All I require is the right amount of energy. He's basically he's plugged into chat that GPT. That would also mean you'd be able to track down the Alpha Natiba. That's enough for introductions. Adam, please insert the hypercell. Yeah, this is kind of what I expected, really. <laughs> Eve, here. Yeah, we need enough of these Alpha Alpha Natibas or Alpha whatever they're called to get the, the, the necessary parts. And then finally we'll take on what does he call it? The elder? The elder that we've got to beat take down? Beat up. Please follow Adam. Alright, alright. I like this though. So even though he's plugged into what I presume is a mainframe connected to uh, the global supercomputer network, aka the internet, he's still surrounded by books and a typewriter. Just just an observation. Some people like some people like analog. It's like reading a book with pages made out of paper people there's an aesthetic that is enjoyable hyperdrive i think that's um something lily here is already on you know what i mean she's a little she's a little excited about everything we need to knock her down size show her the realities and of the horrors of this world <laughs> just get her to just take it easy calm it down a bit Maybe I need a little of, this, hey, of that as well. This way. Oh, it's so dark. I really don't like the dark. This is the hyperdrive, the source of all of Zion's energy. Eve, the hypercell you brought will bring light to Zion. Here, try putting the hypercell in here. Earlier on, by the way, my comment about, like, it's a child, or Lily's really, really young, is just because I don't think you're supposed to think of her like that. Although she's, I mean, she's clearly, she's clearly younger than Eve. She has to be. But I, I, I just think that the way she's portrayed here a little bit is just, like, no, she's not, I don't think she's supposed to be thought of as young. It's the anime thing, you know, sometimes. Anyway, you guys know what I mean. Uh, right, what do I, what, sorry, what have I got to do again? I completely forgot. Adam's not here to... My my robot is not here to scan to tell me. Okay, I'm just gonna press the button. Press the button. Oh, that! God, where have you been keeping that in? People here are in a deep sleep due to energy depletion. Carrying on this way, it can only bring darkness. Eve, please help us. Well, there you go. Oh. Thanks to the hypercell Eve acquired, they're safe. For the time being. I'm glad I was able to do something of significance. What was that? Do we need more hypercells if the citizens ever want to wake up? Yes. We need three more hypercells if we ever want to fully rebuild Zion. Let's go back to Orkul and you can hear the rest of the story. Back to Orkul. Okay. Ma, oh. Outsiders. Thank you for your hard work. Thanks to you, the lives of tens of thousands of people have been extended. And my personal link is also stabilizing. That's great news! Does that mean we can figure out the location of the Alpha Natiba now? All the Elder's energy is still being directed Who's that? to containing the cradle. Who... who are you? That's right, Lily. Ah, this here is Man, a Sentinel Commander. He also serves as Oracle's bodyguard. My skills are still limited, shall we say, so I am not yet able to reach new areas. 
However, with the power of more hypercells, I'm certain I can track the location of the Alpha Nativa. That's why I'll have to ask you for a little more help. Altus Lavoir, a place out in the wasteland, a ruin of the past. Can we count on you to retrieve another hypercell from there? Eve, I'm sure it'll be of help. Yes. We have no other choice. Adam, Lily, I'll be counting on you. It won't be easy. Make sure to be well prepared. Honestly, the designs of these characters, that's one of the things this game has got 10 out of 10, is the, the, the character designs, their armor, their features, the faces, everything is top to bottom. I'm quite literally in this case, really, really amazing designs. But there is something that's bothering me. After seeing man, right, that guy, that man, I've got a horrible feeling that that guy we just met is not a good guy. We're going to be collecting these, these, uh, these, whatever they're called, these energy cells for nefarious purposes. I think there's a, there's a darker, deeper plan here. We're going to get stabbed in the back. But for now, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. We will pick up from where we left off in the next one. This is kind of cool, though. I, I mean, it's good we're in Zion. We can have an explore of the city, hopefully, in the next part. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take care and good night.